Hi everyone, welcome to the Climate Report. Today I have a very special guest. I'm here with Alif. She's going to tell us a little bit about the Cognitive Engine. So Click Cognitive Engine is an AI framework. Um, and our, our goal is to build a framework um, that can run algorithms, that can understand user behavior, and that can learn from the user um, so that um, the analytics experiences become much more easier. And uh, the idea is also by leveraging the knowledge about the data which Cognitive Engine gains and by leveraging the associative engine uh, to find interesting insights in the data that will create, create that aha moments for, for our users with the data. And what's the next step? Where do we go from here? Yeah, uh, so right now uh, we have started integrating the research project into the product. Uh, so our customers and users will start uh, seeing the cognitive engine capabilities in the June release which is very exciting. So what we will be looking at is we, are, uh, we will be doing more algorithmic research. Uh, our goal is to build an intelligent system that can find statistically significant insights in the data, hence the use of algorithms. And then the other thing is we want the system to learn from users and create a collective intelligence. Uh, so doing more investments on the machine learning part. So are there any other interesting research projects you could tell us about? Yeah, yeah, we always do. We have interesting ideas. Um, I think we will continue to work on the Click Cognitive Engine. There are many things to do, research. Uh, but what makes us super excited is what is going on with Click Core, and also especially being able to run the engine on uh, new platforms like Linux, which means that you can literally run the engine, the Beast, on these small devices. This is a Raspberry Pi, and for me, seeing the engine running on this was a huge thing. So this opens opportunities like doing edge analytics, IoT, real-time use cases. Um, yeah, there is so many things to innovate. <laughs>